Hey everyone, I'm Nog and welcome back to Factory Town. So I was being a bit of an idiot with the steam stuff because we can see here we are getting steam power plus 50 and plus 50 and plus 50 and as well down here in the workshops we are, are getting uh, plus 50. So yeah, uh, but let's try and Let's see, if we say C and put one there, will this then get no? So the farms do not benefit from steam, which makes sense, I guess. So that's fine. We do have a problem over here. We are running out of grain for this farm and I guess for the others as well. So we do need to change this up at some point. But one thing I noticed where I also messed up a bit is our school, because our school needs mana crystals in order to be able to research the mana transmission. So we are going to move our school because we don't really have any mana crystals around here. So we do have a bunch of mana shards here, and I think this would be a fine place to put our school and research. So that is what we're going to do. We have some trees for our wood. And yeah, we can move everything up here to this plateau and get our school going again, I think. Is there a better place for it? I don't think there is. I suppose this up here is a very nice place because we have mana shards and loads of trees. So yeah, that could be anywhere else. We have mana shards here and loads of trees and we have grain. Actually, I think I'll put it over here. Yeah. So let's do that because we want our school researching, right? So let's say move you and we'll move you. Let's put you here. And then we need the workshop, which will move. And I think we'll put a barn in between. So there, and then build a barn here. And then we need lumber mill, which needs water. So we'll put that down here. Actually, yeah, the lumber mill does need water. So we'll put that down here. And then we need our pasture, which also needs water. Hmm. Let's actually remove a few resources here. We'll remove this earthstone and this coal. Okay. It's not a whole lot of mana shards we have here though. How many are in one of these? 200 and... Ah, there is quite a bit. But... We're going to need more than that, I think. So it might not be a good spot for it. It might not be a good spot for it. Because we do... We need water, we need... Hmm... We could actually... Uh, there's not enough trees up there. I think this is probably going to be the best spot. We have trees, we have... Have, we're going to build a forest or any right way, right? So it doesn't matter if they're trees. We just need a ton of mana shards. Which we have up here. Hmm. You know what? We're going to build it up here. I think. Or are we? The indecision, the indecision, mana shards, loads of trees, loads of mana shards, and other stuff that we don't really care about. So you know what, let's build it here. 
let's delete a ton of resources. We won't have to plant trees. Not that many anyway. So that's nice. Okay. I think that does it. Let's remove that and that. And we'll remove some of this over here as well. And we might even level the terrain a little bit. Go. Okay. Let's level the terrain a bit. Uh, eight. There we go. Not too much, just a little bit. Like so. I think. And we'll do like this. All right. So let's try this again, shall we? Uh, move the school. We'll move the school up here. We need the barn for that. There. We need the workshop for the books. We need a magic sword, forge, forge, uh, building the magic forge, which we can stick here, I suppose, somewhere. Let's just stick it there for now. It needs to make mana crystals, we know that. But before we put that in, I want, where is it? There it is. I want our pasture, which will make leather for the books. So that can be here. And we want our grain mill, which we'll put up here somewhere. We put it. Hmm. Actually, let's remove a few more resources, some trees here. We need the grain. And let's level this up a bit, like so. Okay. And then we'll move. Let's move the farm first. And get that situated with the grain so we don't have to plant it. Let's see, will that do? Yeah, it'll do. So we'll put that there. And you are set to grain only, yes. And then we need the grain mill. which we'll put up here. And we of course need the well. Move that. So it's right here. I think we'll put it there. And we need the forester. Let's see, where do we want to put the forester? Let's just plonk it down there for now. And we're going to have to level this up a bit, I think. Come on, oh, we need to move you. Just move you over there. And get this leveled up a bit. There. And actually, Level down a bit, like that. Okay, then we can move the Forester. Stick the Forester here. And move the Magic Forge. 
it will go up here. It needs to come into the school. So let's actually let's put it here maybe. Yeah. And I think that's it. Then we need some for you. And we need some wood for our workshop. That workshop is making paper. So that needs a well as well. Let's copy that and stick a well in here. Actually, let's move it to the other side. And I want logistics blocks. No, I want paths. And I actually, uh, let's see, paths. I want the middle conveyor belts on four. I don't want to use the cloth ones anymore. So we'll do that. We'll do that. We'll do that. We will do... Actually, that just needs to be a... Shoot. But that needs to be... Uh... And... Uh, oh. This one... We need a grabber for. And tell it only to grab leather. Go there. And we are producing books. And the books are going into the school. So we do need wood for this, right? Don't we need wood for the... You're making books only. And that's fine. So we don't... Don't we need paper? Yeah, we need four paper. Okay. I thought so. So this will go... Like that. And the forester is making wood. Why is it not outputting the wood? It's not outputting the wood because we don't have grabbers on these. So there we go. That up too high? Oh. Where's our lumber mill? Didn't we, did we not put the lumber mill in? Our lumber mill is down there. Darn it. Okay. So we're missing a step. Let's just stick that in there. We can delete this. And we can put the lumber mill in over here. And then it's actually fine with that. And the, this well needs to go next to that. Go like that. And we'll put in that, and that, and put in grabbers as well. There we go. So that should mean that we're getting leather, or producing leather, uh, we are. Okay, that's fine, we are producing paper which we need to come out on a conveyor. And there, and a grabber. There. Okay, so you're getting paper and you are producing books. Good. Now all we need is this magic forge. 
going and we do have the fire we need a worker we need a harvester drill to grab mana shards and bring them over there and then we need a conveyor belt to bring this up to the school Whoa, why is... Whoa, 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 whoa. That's not good. I do not want the paper on there. Um, let's just delete those. And delete these. I didn't want to delete the... That thing. Let's put this in here instead. Actually, we could put it in here and just have it go straight and put a grabber there. Is this working? Yes, it is. And is the school researching? Yes, it is. Outstanding. The barn is full of books because this is full of writing materials. Okay. Oh, we need a shoot there, right? So we can make our leather. It takes eight seconds. It only takes five seconds to make a book. Increase the speed on that. How long does it take to make paper? Four seconds. But we won't be getting enough paper, I think. It will actually be the problem right now. Yeah. It is. But we are researching. We are up to nine. And it's going. And the mana forge is going see is it getting enough yeah it is it has plenty of writing materials i think we're fine more or less at least what we could do i suppose is hook the lumber mill up to steam increase the speed a little bit more and just hope that the forester can keep up I suppose that's a thing The Mana Forge doesn't use that much fire, right? I mean, that will be supplied and backed up constantly. So we can't increase the lumber mill production except by providing it with steam power, which we have down here. Hmm. Let's, um, let's try that. It is a long way to pull that steam power, but let's try it. And stick it in there. So now, that's plus 42%. So is this gonna build up? Maybe. Not quite, it looks like. Can we speed up the steam generator? We can. Let's do that. And see, does that help? Yes, it does. Okay, so we should be producing enough paper now. I hope. We're actually running... Our supply of leather is going down. Why is that? We're not producing grain fast enough or animal feed. Try this. See, I want it basically running continuously. And the problem is the farm. We need two farms on this, really? 
really don't want to do that. It's pretty much running all the time, so we'll say it's okay. And what are we up to? 31. Okay, so we're getting there. Very nice. Good. Which means that we can go down here and clean up this mess that we have down here. So let's clean that up. And be done with it. And we have a forester thing here that we can stick in if we need it at, at some point. Oh, there's more. Okay. So that's gave us a lot of space to work with, which is a good thing. Okay. This stonemason is completely full and not outputting anything. Let's just stick a worker in here and fill this barn up with stone brick. Whoops. He can just stand there and fill it up. Actually, you can't. We'll put in a metal conveyor instead. And that'll get stone out of there and this guy producing so we get more stone bricks stored up which is fine good good all right and this is completely backed up we are not producing enough iron plate out of this thing and that's because we're not getting enough iron here hmm you know what let's make another shoot here and tell you to stick it there and you to stick it there and you to stick it there and then grab one more and you to stick it there hopefully that'll help they don't have to fight to put the, put the iron down. That should help some. That should help some. Yeah, I think it does. I think it does. Are we looking? Yeah, 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 yeah. Perfect, perfect. The iron is going up here, which means that it'll be producing more frequently, which means that we will have more production. And we are full on rail tiles, so that is really cool. We could start doing some rail stuff. and I want to do rail stuff. Really, really do. But first, I actually, I really want to upgrade our base. We need enchanted books and we actually need purple coins. So what can we sell for purple coins? Um, let's see. Could we sell... We could sell mana brick actually. Get some purple stones. Um, what about mana crystals? Do we have any of those here? Where, where are the mana crystals? I don't see the mana crystals. Mm. No. Okay. So mana brick, if we could get that going down into a speciality goods store, which will be there. That would be fantastic. Start generating some mana crystals or uh, some uh, some purple coins. It won't be a lot, but it will be coming in slowly, and then we will save up for our base. Hmm. Oh, yeah. I'm not really 
really sure how, what to do about that. Not really sure. Why do we have mana crystals in here? And paper and leather and books. I don't get it. Don't get it. Anyway, let's see how's the school doing. 72% or 72, well, it is 72% because it's 100, so 73%. So we're, we're getting there. We're getting there. Slow but steady. Okay. So how do we get these mana bricks down? Oh, we can upgrade our barns as well. I'd forgotten about that. We could just run a belt, I guess, down to a barn here and have a cart pick up and deliver. But we do need mana break for uh, the actual upgrade as well. So maybe we should build another barn for it. You know what, let's do that. Let's try something here. We'll build a barn here. And we will build... Actually, let's delete that barn. And that. And just level this terrain out a little bit. Whoops, I didn't want to go that far down. Something like that. And then build the barn. And then we will get something going into that. And what's going into that is going to be mana bricks. Okay. So we will be getting mana bricks going in there. And we have our own personal storage in there of 100, which might not be enough, but. And then we need the metal conveyors. And this is going to be a long conveyor. So we can get it going over here. And what if we take it down to here? And then get it going over this way. Actually, let's get it down to there, and then get it going over this way. This is going to be a mess. Uh, uh, there. And we need a barn. Let's just stick it there for now. We can always move it, and this is not by any means permanent, right? So let's build up here and the wood arches, and then we should be able to get this going over there. We're going to need so much mana break for this uh, to be of any use, really. Oh, there we go. Research mana transmission. New building, unlock mana transmitter, mana receiver, mana pipe, mana pipe, and mana power we can now research. Mana crystals can be sent long distances via ethereal mana pipes. A mana transmitter will send them into a pipe network and a mana receiver to return Piped items back to their physical form. Okay, very cool. Uh, let's just pause for a second. Uh, I want a worker and I want a wagon. And I want that wagon to grab those and bring over there. And then we can start up again. And I, of course, want to look at the school and say, you search mana power. Man, this is getting expensive. 
we're gonna do it, of course. Okay. And are we... Yeah, we are generating purple coins. Slowly, but we're generating them. So that's good. We are generating purple coins. I love it. I love it. Okay. Good. But that is all we have time for in this episode, guys. I think we made some really good progress, so that's nice. So thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time.